All right, we're going to go through volume support. And I have a 980 pulled up here. So we'll go ahead and enter the setup menu. And volume support is, uh, in short, it's basically the same as CPAP and pressure support, only it has a targeted volume. So it's a spontaneous mode, which means all of the patient's breath are spontaneous. The spontaneous breath is defined as one that the patient can determine his or her own tidal volume, flow, and frequency. And it can be influenced by pressure support, and certainly it does deliver some flow and some pressure boost, but the patient is ultimately in control of it. There is no control variable. So spontaneous, and then we have volume support. Notice you could do pressure support, tube compensation, or volume support. So right now we're gonna talk about the volume support. Volume support basically is where you are going to allow the ventilator to determine the amount of pressure support needed to reach the target volume. That is not a controlled volume. It's not delivering 300 milliliters. It's delivering a level of pressure support. It's reading the exhale tidal volume and then it's going to go ahead and jump the pressure support up or down by up to three centimeters of water pressure to achieve that target volume. The advantage here is that the patient may have varying levels of effort. They may be sedated, waking up, uh, they may wear out, they may not feel good. Any of those things that make people wean well or not so well uh, can be helped with volume support because as somebody gets tired, it's gonna go ahead and up the amount of support. And as they get stronger, it'll decrease the amount of support. And so, it's just the right amount of pressure support to deliver a target volume, which by the way, any spontaneous breath should be set, uh, the help should be set to achieve five to seven milliliters per kilogram of ideal body weight, reasonable work of breathing, and a respiratory rate uh, that is below 20 or 25, whatever, whatever you want. Often when we just come in and set pressure support, <clears throat> It's a fixed level. It doesn't change itself. It's uh, if the patient wears out, <clears throat> the volumes will suffer. Um, the amount of pressure support may be too much. It may be too little. If it's too much, it's not really a wean. If it's too little, they're going to get tired. They're going to wear out faster. So with volume support, again, it'll vary to uh, achieve that target volume. It's also why people use tube compensation because uh, it adjusts just the right amount of support to overcome the resistance of the tube. The downside of tube compensation is that it will not add additional pressure support if the patient needs it. So volume support, we're gonna set a target volume. It's gonna hop the pressure up and down to achieve the desired tidal volume but it also has limits that you can set if you don't want the, to use too much pressure or too much volume you can set those limits as well now if this jumping the pressure up and down to achieve a desired tidal volume sounds familiar to you well then you're probably very familiar with volume control plus because that's what that does as well the modes are very similar except that VC Plus uh, is, has a little bit more control over the patient's breathing where VC, or volume support is totally spontaneous mode where the patient has a little more control. But they are very similar in, in what they do and how they read. And hopefully that gives you an idea of how to work volume support. So if somebody asks you what it is, uh, what I would say is it's, in short, it's the same as CPAP pressure support, uh, except that it uh, tries to deliver a target volume. Other than that, it's, it's pretty much the same. So we'll go ahead and hit accept. So you can see, now I obviously have to trigger breaths. 
Another difference between this and volume support, there's no backup breaths. These are all spontaneous. You can see they're all pressure supported to achieve that volume. And that is all. Hopefully that helps you understand volume support a little better.